All right, it is Wednesday, the day after elections in America. And it is, today is a day for me to, whew, after so much rain, last four days of solid rain in Barbados, to do some, some hedge trimming, tree trimming, pruning, cleaning up my garden. It's a lot of work but it has to be done so here i am at my property uh, getting into the first phase of cleaning and trimming my plants you can see there's two big bags there full of trimmings the lawn has to be cut that is the last thing i'm going to attempt to do but for now what I'm doing is just cutting, trimming, cutting and trimming. As you can see, after rain, well, the miraculous power of the heavenly waters really sets your foliage. Bring up here. Um, one thing I have a big problem with is my broken villa. The snails can't believe it. The snails are actually eating the leaves, even though these broken villa have thorns. I just don't understand how they're getting to climb the tree with the thorns and eating all the leaves off. Look at this. So I'm going to get some blue pellets and sprinkle around the area. I think there's those African giant snails, maybe our slugs. So I'm going to work on that, but now it's just a tremendous amount of cleaning up to do. I cut down my like a tree because it was harboring too much white flies, sooty mole, and lots of white flies. I had to place, you know, look at, see, had all my fencing, nasty, ugly and nasty, so cut it down. I'm gonna plant some hibiscus there. And, and I'm gonna plant some hibiscus also in this area here that needs a clean up. But this is it. This is it. Lots of work to be done. But you know, this is what I love to do, so it's not a problem for me. So, it's a lot of work, but it has to be done. One of the trees, a califa, Sansevera, Sansevera, a califa, Amanda, there. So I'm waiting on my helper to come back so we can finish this job. There are the tools of my trade. One thing I must tell you, if you are going to work, doing this kind of work, protect yourself, always get some arm sleeves like this. Okay, protect your con complete arm and your hands because I'll show you you never know what has 
been in these trees before you. For example, that is a dead mice. See? If he had peed in the foliage, you didn't protect yourself like this. Possibly you can catch lectospirosis. I had a few clients that came to me for sleeves and one guy had caught lectospirosis as a gardener and the other guy his entire hands was scarred like he has like if, if he was somebody had lashed him with a cat nine tails on his arms it was scary because he is a gardener and he said that when he's trimming hedges sometimes all the the branches and the thorns will scratch his hands and his hands are just very scratched so he bought some sleeves from me um, if you don't have and you want to get a pair of sleeves you can contact me um, message me on Facebook and we can make arrangements for you to collect them so anyhow I'm gonna finish this video now and wait until my guy gets back bye I hope you voted the right way today.